going down to Georgia Tech that this year was huge. I mean, I think that really opened the window, the door to say um, to Tampa because being with those high level girls, being in that atmosphere, um, being around, you know, those high level kids, uh, you know, I'm around high level, but to be in that whole other world kind of gets you geared up for Tampa and it, it makes it a little bit less um, kind of nerve wracking or scary to go into. You're kind of a little bit more ready. Georgia Tech really got the ball rolling. Georgia Tech was good. Penn Relays was better. Max was great. And I think it's, it's allowed us to create a lot of really positive momentum with Sarah where she feels like she can go up against anybody in the country and hold her own. So I think going into Max, you know, we were a little bit, I was nervous, you know, going up a really good competitor, Jessica Lee. Um, so just to kind of go through that prelim and it went pretty smoothly and that felt good going into finals. And then finals was the biggest thing was just not focusing on time. It was just kind of like, let's run our race. You know, we've had high emotion the past couple of weeks. So, you know, just bring it what we've got. And it turned out to be a very high emotional moment crossing the line for sure. Um, I think in the outdoor hurdles, now the top four kids we've ever had have all been here in the last five years. Um, so Sarah was really able to come into an environment that was already high achieving. And I think that really helped bring out the best in her as a hurdler. It's just such a monumental moment to show how far of a program we've come. Like, I think, especially our hurdle program, like, we're, we're going to Tampa, we're going to regional. So I hope that just like continues from here on out. We spent a ton of time working on her as a sprinter, working on her blocks, working on really, you know, basically the first eight steps of the race, getting up and over the first hurdle. And we've been able to see how that's paid off in championship races this year because she's now a kid that gets out even with people to the first hurdle and it's really transformed you know, who she is as a hurdler. So we've been uh, prepping a lot for NCAAs. I think um, right now it's really just kind of keep moving. Um, we do a couple sprint drills here and there and it's really working on the technical things right now. Um, I don't think there's a whole lot to change, you know, just keep the momentum because again, it's been an emotional couple weeks. So I think it's just keeping that high emotion and then the rest will kind of fall in place hopefully.